Alrighty. Howdy neighbors and welcome back to Undertale. Last time we fought Undyne. Jesus Christ. <laughs> she whooped me so hard. So many times. Aw, oh, the welcome to Hotland sign isn't going. Forty! Oh my god. Over here. The river person. Hi. Is it still blocked off? Yeah. Oh. It's me. No, it also something. But it's all written in chicken scratch. If I can walk through to a game. Oh. Oh, there you are. You ugly little creature. You made quite a name for yourself. Such infamy! I'm impressed! Oh yes, if you're looking for Alphys, she's not here. While well, you were busy doing your <laughs> thing, she was running around evacuating everyone to safety. Now they're in a place where you'll never get them! Deciding not to fight you. My my, she really is one smart one, isn't she? Oh, how sassy! You're just itching to get your hands on me, aren't you? Well, too bad! This world needs stars more than it needs corpses. Doodles! Nelfus already has some of her own. Ayo! Speaking of corpses, can we get some of that? Some of that sweet corpsey action? Oh, it sounds like a cat. No. Pepper, don't listen. I know what it's time for. Secret ink. Soon they're playing. I never got to. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> uh. Oh, we have a work cut out for us. Dropping bombs.
Vulcan to chat. Oh, yes, I have. And I'm guessing the puzzles aren't going to be too big of a deal. How'd I get him?
in your play anyway. The Vulcan. These, these are not fun. That was not fun. Stop. That is... 19! Let's go, baby! Yeah, it's taking significantly longer. My love increase for now. Uh, love 14. Give me something then. Sitting here shivering. This is a terrible strategy, but I'm doing it anyway. It was entertaining for you guys. Timothy. 
explosion is always like perfect for the attack that movie has. I'm still gonna get copywritten, but it's worth it. Taking a lot longer though.
probiotic at seven. How come a volcano is able to have lightning? Don't tell me. So, there we go. Thank you. I like we're doing this for a very long time. We should be at five. I need to go over here. Let's go over here. See if we have more luck. That's not helpful at all. Makes you want to kill something. <laughs> In case you can tell, I kind of sort of suck at this game. Still no more encounters. Hmm. Seems we have a bunch of cowards here.
Door's already open. <gasps> no, not the boyfriends. You're here. Sammy's Undyne. She's like Undyne. We'll avenge you. Well. well that was fantastic. He was striking his sword against the ground. Thank you for the experience, gentlemen. What did we learn here today? Me? I learned jack shit. We're not. Three left. Why is that still there? What? No! I need the apron. Let's go to R3 then. Or R2. God. L3? Wait, no, this is the bake sale. Fuck. I need to kill everybody before. I think. I'm pretty sure. I don't want to ruin the run. But I think I did. Fuck. I think I just ruined everything. There's still a chance over here, right? She said. She said he brings Jeff Shu will come through. I heard that they hate spiders. I heard that they hate everybody. 
I heard that they like to tear their legs off. I heard. They have some awful taste. What a shame. A human comes through and they aren't even fit to be eaten. Oh well, bad ingredients can always be discarded. Unhand me, wench! Oh. Hi, baby. I'm gonna stomp on you. Oh. Bye. No! <laughs> no! 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 Not Muffet! She's just a little Muffet. I have to be sad about that. But not really. Now, can I go back here? No! Damn it! Fine, whatever! I thought it'd work. Whatever. Like, whatever. It doesn't even matter. Like, it's so good. Hey, go to the creepy alley for some great deals. Coming. But like, nobody came and stuff. Still 5G from the till. Hey, this is Bradia. Hey, this is Katia. If you're reading this, then like, bad news, you mega evil weirdo. Alphys just came and she's taking us someplace super duper safe. But first, we gotta use up these gel pens. Yeah, chill, Alphys. We don't want to waste pens. We don't even think about stealing our stuff. Yeah, creep. Leave our junk alone. Caddy, it's not junk. It's really valuable. Yeah, our garbage is really valuable. Anyway, in closing, you're a total loser. Yeah, loser. <laughs> signed, Braddy. Signed, Caddy. Both with a heart. What am I taking? Junk food. Empty gun. Unfortunately, I need healing items. Get over here. Why do I always get the freaks? Anything else to do? Evacuation. Evacuation? I can't get my chain, little weirdo. So what if everyone else left work? So what if nobody's buying anything? Part for the course, little weirdo. Part for the course. Well, Metaton didn't tell me I had to work, I guess. But that's the thing. Sometimes he doesn't even call me into work until halfway through my shift. If I don't play it safe, he's gonna yell at me. Okay, maybe yell is the wrong term. It's more like he has this CD he plays. It's entirely full of songs that he about how bad I am at my job. Huh? Everyone else is dead. Does that mean I don't have to work today? God, if that were true, little weirdo. If it were true. Sorry, little weirdo. Threats don't work on me. I can't go to hell. I'm all out of vacation days. You know that happens. Uh, yeah, I really want to buy your weird, dusty artifacts. Not. Ooh. Is attack in battle? It's 300 gold. This is 500. Heal 60. Well, 
make some. Alone again. I can easily fix that for you, buddy. Two left. I don't plan to judge you for your sins. The fire isn't even activated! Bitch. find more stuff on the ground, you know? Cause like everyone's leaving. Robot bones? Come here. Robot bones. Robot bones. Robot bones. Come here. Yes! My, my. So you finally arrived. After our first meeting, I realized something ghastly. You're not just a threat to monsters, but humanity as well! Oh my, that is an issue! You see, I can't be a star without an audience! And besides, there's some people I want to protect! Ahaha, ha, here as always, eh? But don't touch that dial! There's something you haven't accounted for! As any true fan would know, I was first created as a human eradication robot. It was only after becoming a star that I was given a more photogenic body. However, those original functions have never been fully removed. Come any closer and I'll be forced to show you my true form. Oh, please do. Oh, I beg. I plead and I beg. Fine then. Ready? It's showtime! Show me. Oh, Metaton Neo blocks the way. I shot a robot with a gun. Why did that work? G Guess you don't want to join my fan club. He just exploded. <laughs> that was the most anticlimactic. <laughs> what was the point? He did nothing. Metaton has done absolutely nothing for me. Get this long elevator right over with. I 
Ned is taking a sweet time, ain't it? I better start singing. It's an elevator. I'm level 19. It's supposed to be all the enemies coming up, but now we don't have any encounters, so that's funny. We're just walking. Like it ain't nothing. God, I love the genocide route. Use the box. I have so many legendary heroes. The way it should be. Find the keys. Ooh, heart shaped locket. I'm carrying too much. No! Take these heroes out of here. Only villains. I forgot that these were in here. Took the locket. Knife inside. What well, you're taking? I will take it. You got the real knife. Where it belongs. The locket. You can feel it beating. Armor defense 99. Right where it belongs. Real knife. Here we are. Yes. About time. So my attack is 99. My defense is 99. <sighs> Absolutely beautiful. Howdy, Ems! We finally made it home! Remember when we used to play here? <laughs> Boy, today's gonna be just as fun! You took the key and put on your phone's keychain. It's me, Games. It me! When I first woke up here in the garden, I was so scared. I couldn't feel my arms or legs. My entire body had turned to a flower. Mom, Dad, somebody help me! I called out, but nobody came. A flower is very unfortunate. He didn't deserve that. Eventually, the king found me crying in the garden. I explained what had happened to him, and he held me, games. He held me with tears in his eyes, saying, They're there. Everything's gonna be alright. He was so emotional. But for some reason, I didn't feel anything at all. No chocolate. I've read this already. Take the key. Stove top. It's a trash can. So a couple of recipes for butterscotch pie. He went for a stuck in the drain. Disgusting. I unlocked the chain. I love the fact that most of the text is red. The date I came here. I soon realized I didn't feel anything about anyone. My compassion had disappeared. And believe me, it's not like I wasn't trying. I was away from that stupid king, vainly hoping I would feel something. But it became too much of me. I ran away from home. Eventually, I reached the ruins. Inside, I found her. I thought about people, she would make me feel whole again. She failed. Ha <laughs> ha. I realized those two were useless. I became despondent. I just wanted to love someone. I just wanted to care about someone. You might not believe this, but 
but I decided it wasn't worth living anymore. Not a world without love, not a world without you. So, I decided to follow in your footsteps. I had to erase myself from existence. And you know what? I succeeded. <laughs> Question mark. But as I left this mortal coil, I started to feel apprehensive. If you don't have a soul, what happens when you... So the primal started to burn inside me. No, I thought. I don't want to die. Then I woke up. Like it was all just a bad dream. I was back in the garden. Back at my save point. Interested, I decided to experiment. Again and again, I brought myself to the edge of death. At any point, I could have let the world continue without me. But as long as I was determined to live, I could go back. Amazing, isn't it? I was amazed too. At first, I used my powers for good. I became friends with everyone. I solved all the problems flawlessly. The companionship was amusing. For a while. As time repeated, people proved themselves predictable. What would this person say if I gave him this? What would they do if I said this to them? Once you know the answer, that's it. That's all they are. Not necessarily. It all started because I was curious. Curious what would happen if I killed him. I don't like this, I told myself. I'm just doing this because I have to. Because I have to know what happens. Ha ha ha. What an excuse. You of all people must know how liberating it is to act this way. I think we're better than those sickos that stick around and watch it happen. Those pathetic people who want to see it but are too weak to do it themselves. I bet someone like that's watching right now, aren't they? It's me. I'm both doing it and the coward that doesn't want to do it. <laughs> Nowadays, even that's grown tiring. You understand? I've done everything this world has to offer. I've read every book. I've burned every book. I won every game. I lost every game. I appeased everyone. I killed everyone. Because of numbers, lines of dialogue, I've seen them all. But you, you're different. I never could predict you. In my bone stealing ways. When I saw you in the ruins, I didn't recognize you. I thought I'd frighten you to steal your soul. And I failed. Then I tried to load my save. It didn't work. Your determination. Somehow that's greater than mine. I totally don't know what voice is happening now. <clears throat> I got one question to ask you. How did you get back to the ruins from here? Wait, I know. She was to take you when she left. I decided to give you a proper burial rather than lay down in the basement forever. But why? What made you wake up? Did he hear me calling you? It doesn't matter now. I'm so tired of this. I'm tired of all these people. I'm tired of all these places. I'm tired of being a flower. Hey, there's just one thing left I want to do. Let's finish where we started. Let's free everyone. And then, let's see, oh, let them see what humanity is really like. And despite it all, this world is still kill or be killed. You're next, flower. <laughs> then, well, my head been entertaining a few ways to use that power. Hehehe. <laughs> but seeing you here changed my mind. I think if you're around, just living on the surface world doesn't seem so bad. Ooh, don't tell me that. But I gotta happen. We don't even need to leave to get them this time. The king has six of them locked away. I tried hundreds of ways to get him to show them to me. But he just won't. Hey. I'm sure he'll do it for you. Why am I telling you all this? I said it before. Even after all this time, you're still the only one that understands me. You don't give me any worthless pity. Creatures like us wouldn't hesitate to kill each other if we get in each other's way. You are absolutely correct. Now quiver. So that's... So that's why... Yes. Shake. Heh. <laughs> What's this feeling? Why am I shaking? Hey, uh, don't hurt feelings about back there, right? 
Hey, how are you doing? Back off. Now you're in my way. Ah, I've changed my mind about all this. This isn't a good idea anymore. You need to go back. This place is found the way it is. Stop making that creepy face. This isn't funny. I've got a sick sense of humor. And this is where I'm ending the episode. On the precipice of my extinction. I'm all ready. Say one more time, and I'm gonna end the episode here. So thank you very much for watching. And hopefully, I will see you later.